You're tuning into the All on the Table podcast. Your discretion is advised. All on the Table podcast. Process. KC. Semis of Roddy mixed on. Cash money. Boom! Got a martini right there. Yeah, ain't got some stuff. Hey, what a, what a, hey. Like, what a year. Like, but but you know, hey, my bad. Hey, y'all it's talking about these hard ass rap- dog. Y'all talking about these fucking dope ass rappers from Philly. This vodka. motherfucker got a hashtag Philly hat on with a martini in his hand. Yeah, dog. I ain't even. I'm fuck it up for all y'all. Man, like, hold up, we got a martini. Hey man, what's wrong with a martini, man? Nothing, 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 brother. You know. Hey Brian. Hey Brian. Uh, I, we were talking. I drink earth. brown myself, so you know. But I don't. I used to drink white all the time. Hey, I'm trying I'm not to wake up with a hangover though. I got brown. Okay, okay. Got a whole bar full of that shit. <laughs> hey, we were talking we were talking earlier, Brian, that um Are you stick with uh, your motherfucking Bud Light, fucking goddamn Clint. What? <laughs> it's Thomas, get my shit right. That's right, <laughs> fucking Thomas. But uh Nas, Nas uh something came out with Nas had a, a couple disc bars on Tupac. It was about a minute and forty five seconds worth of track. Who's winning that who's winning that uh battle, Tupac or Nas? <laughs> This is recently? Yeah, it just came out today. No, he recorded it a while ago, a long time ago, but for some reason it just just leaked out today. Ah, Nas. You think Nas is winning it? Yeah. So I first was thinking that, and then when we all started talking about it, it it's like, I don't think, so Nas is one of those people that's like, oh, he got to perfect what he writes. Tupac would have dropped like 10 tracks on a whole album on him and would have just like avalanched him and made it way more personal. Like if you look at the Machiavelli album, right? Like, that's just straight war report, like, trash talking, I'm going to destroy your whole family type shit. I I think Tupac would get it just because of that. Nas would take too long, try to be too perfect. So you're saying, you're saying, like, volume over quality. Yep. Yeah, that's that's a sensitive subject. See, that's the the thing. That's a sensitive subject. You know know what's crazy? What you're saying (laughs) that I can understand what you're saying, volume over Mm -hmm. over quality, Mm -hmm. right? Tupac's volume would have been so much quality that it would have overshadowed the one track that Nas would have put out. Maybe. It depends on the timing of it, right? No, if you listen, a dog, rear rear form Pac, rear form Pac. You, you gotta think about that. We talking about we ain't talking about Brenda got a baby pop. We talking about rare form pop. Those two different motherfuckers right there, cuz they two completely different people. Rare form Pac didn't give a fuck. Everything that touches that pin was going to be like fucking missiles going towards Baghdad. <laughs> pretty much. That's the whole Machiavelli <laughs> album. Pretty exactly. Much. Like, it would have been no holes bar, huh? What's no your favorite al- What's your favorite Pac album, Brian? Uh, it's tough, right? Yeah, dude. I mean... Can't throw the greatest hits in there as an album, right? No, no <laughs> hell no. <laughs> no, no, no. We're not cheating, son. All right. Probably, uh, probably all eyes on me. Yeah. Okay. That seems to be the consensus. No, I'm telling you, if that was, if that would have been a single album, that would have been a top for me. I still am confused about this whole you wanting it to be dwindled down to one album. Be- listen, think about. I don't like, know what. What do you? Okay, so, so if you keep thinking that, name one track that you're removing from that album from those double discs. See, you you're not. The thing is, you're not understanding what I'm saying. You looking at it. You looking at it differently than I'm looking at it. If you take all eyes on me had what I think it was like a total of like 24, 26 songs somewhere around here, right? Right. If you take those 26 songs and take the, the top 12 to 15 songs out that 26, that would be the greatest album ever. I think it was the greatest album ever, regardless. With it's not both better, CDs. It's not, better, it's not better. And even as a double disc, it's still not better than the purple tape. It's still not better than the purple tape. What is this purple tape you're talking about? Here, listen, this is what I'm gonna do, right? <laughs> no, 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 no. On some real shit. I fucks with you, Cash. Please don't take my please don't take my black card. No, 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 no. That motherfucker's <laughs> gone, man. He said that motherfucker's gone, man. You, you like a brother to me, Cash. No real shit. Yeah, you I'm like the, 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 gray, the grayest white brother I've never had. That's what you are to me, right? So this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna see you in within these next couple of weeks, I'm gonna see you. And I'm gonna play the purple tape for you. When the last song finished playing. The, when the last song 
ends. I'm gonna take my hand. I'm gonna make like a cup formation, and, and if I don't, I'm gonna slap the shit out you in the back. Oh, of the <laughs> I didn't like where this was going. So, Look, you build that smack the fuck up. You build that smack up exactly because you can't call yourself a hip hop dude. I should not have to say the name of the album. I should only be able to say the purple tape for you. Now, how about this, Feast? What's the purple tape? And I you don't know. Than everybody. I don't know. <laughs> I know. Peace, I'm gonna come see you tomorrow. Right? I'll look. See? I'll see look. Exactly. I got, I, don't hey, know. I got my card back. <laughs> <laughs> that shit was on the table. That shit was gnawed, right? Somebody reneged on that one. I got to, I can get the card yeah. back. The purple tape, the, ter- the purple tape is Ray Kwan only built for Cuban Links album. The okay, reason, I can agree with that. The reason everybody called it the purple tape because it was the first actual album that came out on anything besides the clear cassette tape. He put his out on an actual purple tape to make it actually stand out to everybody else. So So it's tinted. Literally, even him, nobody calls it only built for Cuban links. Everybody calls it the purple tape. That is literally like, it's crazy because that like basically became the name of the fucking album. So the fact that show you didn't notice, like that just... Like irked me a little bit. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. I, I, no, I fuck with Wu Tang, but I didn't go so deep into all every character of Wu Tang. Somebody, somebody like you know what? I can't even say that. I can't even say somebody like Beast for the simple fact that your wife's mom listened to all this shit with me. So I'm pretty sure your wife was put on to this shit. So I'm pretty sure she put you on to this shit. She didn't put me on to nothing. Oh, that's some bullshit. Y'all need to get on the She ain't, she probably don't even know. Babe! <laughs> <laughs> Calling her down. Hey, she yo. went to the store? Uh-huh. All right, she went to the store. She don't be knowing shit either. Brian, hey, you shit. drinking? It's happy hour. Yeah, man. You know I am. Got oh, my rum. What do you get? With the, why the straw, though? Exactly. <laughs> hey, where's I, I, your, hey, where's your Bud Light, Thomas? Right here. Why the straw, though? I can need the explana- explanation for that. I grabbed it to stir it and oh, okay. kept it. I ain't got no straw, but I got some motherfucking olives, dog. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen, let me. He likes it dirty. Hold on, oh, hold on. Okay, go ahead. I'll finish your thought, and I'll, I'll go into the next thing I wanted to talk about. Hey, man, so, yeah, let him talk so his fucking head can go down. Suck a dick. <laughs> Deflate a little bit. This nigga's crowding the motherfucking screen because his head's swollen. <laughs> you got that light in the corner. You it's got put, a lot of thought this, up in that motherfucker. I didn't, I didn't ask you. That's just putting solar spots on the screen. You don't see that? Listen, as grown men, y'all should not be worrying about my head. <laughs> this look like Event Horizon on <laughs> that motherfucker. Hey, leave my boy Slick James alone, goddamn. Oh, it. shit. Slick James. <laughs> hey, Fee, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> so listen, let me ask y'all this, right? It's 